Hello and welcome to all in this video lectures series on C programming. In this video lecture, we are going to discuss a concept of function call by reference. So basically we know that the function, what is function? The fun function is basically the set of different instructions which are written together or step by step to perform specific task or to perform a task right and now here basically we have three main steps the first one is called as function declaration function declaration the second one is called as function call and third one is called as what simple function definition right and uh, we have seen right what is function declaration at the top we are going to declare a function which mainly deals with what the features are going to give the idea about a features then the variables that are used during the function or during the program and it is going to convey the same to compiler the function call we are going to call the function for execution and here the definition what definition defines it mainly defines the task that performed by the function right so when i'm going to focus on the step number two that is a function call mainly there are two types of it the first one is called as a function call by value okay so function call by value and the second one is called as a function call by reference okay and in today's video session we are going to talk about function call by reference so what basically it indicates just recall we want to do the addition of two numbers right so how simple we are going to declare simple int add then one variable integer x second variable integer y right and uh, sorry inside the main function i am going to write say int main and here suppose i am going to declare the function right so that is what my add function and i'm going to put the two values say 5 and 6 right or to go with some variables let us consider i'm going to declare two variable the first variable say variable a is equal to 5 and variable b is equal to 6 and then i'm writing here add a comma b right okay and during its definition i am going to write integer this add function and inside this add again integer x comma integer y and inside it again say integer z and now z is equal to x plus y and after this simple print f this percent d comma z and now i'm going to put simple written here as a zero right so when i'm going to talk about okay let me put out here when i'm going to talk about this entire execution here when i'm going to call the function right this specific step which represents your function call then what we does okay simple i'm going to put the values of 5 and 6 right here the value of a and value of b what is the value of a it is 5 value of b is a 6 now the 5 the value of a is get assigned to x and the value of b is assigned to y so what in short we did simple i am calling the function this add function i am calling by passing exact the values of this variable and this concept is mainly called as what function call by value what we did simple here I am going to directly pass the value from this calling function to call function. In short, the add function is called by sending directly the values here. So this concept is called as what? 
call by function call by value in short the calling function is sending a values to the called function however by reference means what instead of forwarding these values what we are going to do we are going to forward simple the address of the variable that means here if i am going to say add in bracket a comma b what we did we are giving the values of this variable however if i am writing add instead of passing the value of the variable simple i am going to pass the values of the address of the variable in short my program will be like this integer add in bracket say and now we are supposed to use the pointer here integer x pointer y and integer integer pointer x and integer pointer y okay and then here in main function again a int a is equal to 5 comma b is equal to 6 the same step here but when i am calling this add function right here what i am going to do i am going to write ampersand x sorry a comma ampersand b so what will happen here if you focus okay let me uh, just go with this proper right if you see this specific definition no doubt here this declaration is also changed here instead of dealing with only variable what we did simple i'm going to declare the pointer which is going to point out that values here and here the value of a and b transferred as it is but what we did here i'm going to pass the address of a and address of b just try to get this this is the difference that exists here i am passing the address of variable a and address of variable b okay from calling function to call function okay in this main function we are doing this right so here actually this is a definition of the main function sorry over here right however here i am passing the values the actual values are passed so that's why it is called as a function call by value whereas here right in this step we are sending the address of this variable and that's why it is called as a call by reference so let us focus here now say integer add integer pointer x and pointer y and then i'm writing integer a comma b then printf first number so here i'm going to assign a value suppose my first value is a 0 5 first i'm going to put a value 0 5 so the value of variable a is now 0 5 and now the second what is that enter the value for b so what is that it's a 0 6 so value of b is now what 0 6 so a is equal to 5 b is equal to 6 and now when i'm going to talk about this the most important ampersand a and ampersand b so what will happen i am passing just try to get this here when i'm going to put the ampersand a and ampersand b what will happen the address of variable a and variable b is now passed here and this address the address of variable a is get assigned to x and address of variable b is get assigned to y let us consider the address of variable a is uh, say 1000 and say suppose b is 1 or 2000 right so in short what will happen at memory location 1000 the value 05 is present and at memory location 2000 value 06 is present and right or means from the uh, the four consecu consecutive locations so 2000 2001 2002 2003 at these four memory locations 06 is present and at 1000 1001 1002 1003 05 is present and the moment at which i am going to send add in bracket ampersand a comma ampersand b what exactly happened ampersand 1000 comma 2000 these addresses are passed from this main function to this call function so now the x the 1000 is get assigned to variable x and 2000 is get assigned to variable y and now when i am going to write this z is equal to this pointer x pointer x means what will happen we have seen what is that when i'm going to put the here the value whatever hold by x is considered as a memory location address and the content present at that memory location is considered for the operation so the entire expression value here just try to get this 
this entire expression value right this entire expression value is nothing but what the value present at 1 0 0 0 and what is that value 0 5 so in short this value is 0 5 plus this value is a 0 6 right so in this way what we did we have used the address of variable as an argument and these are passed from calling function to call function and as we are passing here the memory location address this is called as a simple call by reference so let us cross check that with this simple execution over here right so simple as indicated i am going to pass this ampersand a and ampersand b that is what the memory location addresses and the moment at which i am going to run this code so enter the first number what is my first number say so my first number is 0 5 second number is say 0 6 and finally the addition that is 11 is get displayed on the output screen right so in this way this call by reference concept works in c programming language